Hi, I'm Ashton Lewis, Master Brewer and Residence for the Paul Mueller Company. Today we're going to demonstrate what happens if you hot CIP a tank and follow that hot CIP with a cold rinse. We're going to use a 55 gallon drum here with hot water in it to demonstrate our tank being hot CIP'd. So here we have our model tank that's been hot cleaned and now we're getting ready to rinse with cold water. I have it sealed up and this demonstrates what happens when you have improper vacuum relief. Now we're going to rinse it with cold water and watch what happens. <laughs> so that's vacuum failure, hot CIP, cold rinse. And if that doesn't stress the importance of a proper vacuum relief valve, then I don't know what will. If you have questions in the future about vacuum, vacuum relief, or vacuum relief valves, call Paul Mueller Company. Thank you.